Okay, today we're going to do a fun English quiz. Do you like quizzes? The quiz is only going to have three words, okay? Cord, cable, and wire. What's the difference between cord, cable, and wire? Do you know the difference between these words? Well, we're going to learn in this lesson. We're going to, I'm going to quiz you and tell you the right answers. Hey, if you like getting English quizzes like this, make sure you subscribe for more quizzes in the future. Okay, so the first question is this. Look at this. What is this thing here that connects the mother to her child? What is that? That's called the umbilical cord cable or wire. The umbilical cord cable or wire. Which one is the right answer? Hmm. The umbilical... Are you ready? I'm going to tell you. Okay. It's called the umbilical cord. Okay. This thing here that sort of connects the, the baby to its mother. That's called the umbilical cord. You cannot say umbilical cable. You can't say umbilical wire. It has to be umbilical cord. Okay. So in, in most situations in English, one of those are right. Either cord, cable, or wire. Sometimes we could use maybe one or two, or maybe two would be okay. Um, like I'm going to show you one example in the future with this quiz that two are, are okay. But, but usually we just choose one. One is the right answer. Um, it just sounds strange if you use the wrong word. Okay, so that's why I want to teach you, you know, some, some common things like this so that you can know the right word, whether it's cord, cable, or wire. Okay, so let's take a look at the next one. This is called a telephone. <laughs> well, this is a, a very old fashioned. Do you still have one of these old fashioned telephones in your house? That would be awesome. Do you even know how to use one? I know how to use one of these phones. We had one of these phones when I was a kid. Actually, we had one when I was a, a teenager, when I was in high school. I think, I think we had one of these. Maybe, maybe we had one with the buttons. But, you know, I bet kids nowadays don't even know how to use one of these kinds of telephones. Okay, so look at this. This here. Is this called a telephone cord? cable or wire. How would you describe this thing? Cord, cable or wire? Well, I'm going to tell you. It is the telephone cord. Telephone cord. Okay, it's not telephone wire. It's not a telephone cable. It's a telephone cord. Did I spell that right? Yeah. I thought I spelled that wrong. Okay, so take a look at, at this thing here. What is this? This is a fence. What kind of fence is this? This is a barbed, which word? A barbed cord fence, a barbed cable fence, or a barbed wire fence. Which one is right? What do you think? Well, I'm going to tell you. Hey, maybe you should keep track. You should keep track how many you get right. And then tell me at the end of this lesson down there in the comments, how many you got right and how many you got wrong. I'm, I'm interested to know if, if these are hard for you or if they're easy. Okay. So let's, uh, let's, okay. So this is, is barbed wire. Okay. Barbed wire is the right answer. Okay. Let's do the next one. This is a network cord, cable, or wire. A network cord, a network cable, or a network wire. Hmm. Well, the answer is a network cable. It's a network cable. Okay. Let's do the next one. What's this? This is a USB, a USB cord, cable, or wire. Hmm. What do you think? Are you ready for the answer? The answer is a USB cable. This is a USB cable. You might want to buy one of these on Amazon. Then just search on Amazon for USB cable and you'll find one of these for just just a few dollars. They're really cheap. Okay. Um, now let's look at these. Hey, maybe your car battery is dead here in Canada in the winter. It's very important that you have some of these in your car in case your battery dies 
and you need to boost your battery. Boost means to charge. Okay, so um, what are these called? Are they called booster cords, booster cables, or booster wires? Hmm, what do you think? Well, here's the answer. They're called booster cables. Booster cables. Okay, so if you come to Canada here, you can go to any hardware store and, and get some booster cables. You could go to Lowe's or Canadian Tire or Princess Auto or Home, Home Hardware, Home Depot. You can buy these at any hardware store here in Canada. Okay, so the next one is a bungee. This is called a bungee cord, cable, or wire. Hmm, what do you think? Well, I'm going to tell you. It's called a bungee cord. A bungee cord. Okay, you might need a bungee cord to, uh, you know, maybe you have a bike and maybe you want to carry something on the, on, on the, um, on the rack on the back of your bike, but you don't want it to fall off. So that, then you need a bungee cord to, to strap down the, whatever you're carrying on the back of your bike, right? A bungee cord. Okay. You can't say bungee wire. You can't say bungee cable. It has to be bungee cord. Okay. Let's look at the next one. This stuff is called copper, ooh, copper cord, copper cable, or copper wire. I'm going to give you three seconds. One, two, three. Okay. The answer is copper wire. It's called copper wire. This, this color, is called copper and actually this the material is called copper as well it's a kind of of metal so take a look at this what is this called here you probably need one of these things to plug in your laptop or you know your your shaver or any kind of electronic device you probably need a power cord cable or wire Hmm, a power cord, a power cable, a power wire. Well, with this one, I think you can say power cable or power cord. I think both of those would be common. Um, like I could say, hey, have you seen my, have you seen my power cable? Uh, my battery is low. I can't see my power cable. Have you seen my power cord? My power cord or power cable? I think both of those are, are common. In English okay so you can choose whichever one you want but not wire you can't say power wire okay um, okay what about this look at this long thing okay maybe you need something long to to get electricity to somewhere for example maybe you have Christmas lights on your house it's Christmas time you put some Christmas lights around your house you might need one of these things to plug in the Christmas lights, okay? So this is called an extension cord, cable, or wire. Extension cord, cable, or wire. Ready? It's called an extension cord. An extension cord. Okay, I have, uh, actually I don't have any right now, but I do have, I have an extension cord, but I'm just not using it right now, okay? Um, oh, look at this. This is called a a what car? A cord car, a cable car, or a wire car? What do you think? Hmm. Well, the answer is it's called a cable car. A cable car, okay? You could call these things cables. Cables, it's a cable car. Okay, now look at this picture. Hmm. Which word comes to mind when you see these things here? Are these cords, cables, or wires? What's the first word that comes to your mind? Well, for me, the first word is wires. Okay, look at all these wires. Okay, so wires is the correct answer. It would be weird if you said, look at those cables or look at those cords. Okay, these are wires. Okay, um, so we use the word wire when usually, not always, but usually when, when we're talking about metal. Okay, so when you hear the word wire, you should think metal. Okay, like look at this barbed wire fence. Okay, that's metal. You can see that it's metal. And look at that that copper wire over there. You can see that um, that it's copper. 
Okay, copper is a kind of metal. Okay, so so when you think of wire, try to I mean I think that's the best way to remember to use the word wire is if you can see that it's metal, then it's a pretty good guess to use the word wire. Now, what's the difference between cord and cable? To be honest, that's it's hard. You just have to you have to learn each word separately, okay? Now, some people you know, might say that a cable is thicker than a, a cord, right? A cable is is thicker. Um, like, look at this, okay? This, these could be called cables, not wires. Um, yeah, you can see that's metal, right? It's metal, but we still use the word cable. I mean, there are always exceptions in English. You know, when you learn a rule in English, don't take that too seriously because there are always exceptions, right? We can see this is metal here, but we don't use the word wire, we use the word cable. Okay, so these are booster cables, and that over there is an extension cord, right? They're they're almost the same, right? I think they're about the same thickness. I, I don't think booster cables are really much thicker than an extension cord. So you know how do you how do you learn these how can, how can you use the right word well i think with cord and cable you just have to you just have to memorize you have to learn each each one separately and you know that can seem a little bit um a bit daunting daunting means a bit scary right to learn every one it, you know it's different but you know i think if you if you start to learn some of these like I've shown you in this lesson. If you start to learn them and if you practice them a bit, I think you'll get good at predicting. You'll get good at guessing which the right word is. You'll be able to feel if if it sounds better to use cord or cable. Okay, so that's why, you know, using English, um, being exposed to English. If you live in Canada or the US or some other English speaking country, you will, you'll get the hang of this. So, so don't worry too much, okay? But um, I just wanted to give you this quiz just to, uh, to teach you some of the most common ones like power cord, um, booster cable, extension cord, USB cable, right? Those umbilical, right? when you're a baby inside your mother, it's called an umbilical cord, not cable. Okay. Hey, let's do some homework, okay? Look at that car. That car is pulling this car. What is it using to pull it? Look at this. Okay, this person is hooking up uh, a towing. Okay, that, that, that's called towing, right? When you pull, when one thing pulls another thing, that's called towing. Okay, so that car is towing this car. So this is called a towing cord, cable, or wire. Hmm, towing cord, towing cable, or towing wire. I'm not gonna tell you, I want you to try to guess. Okay, so let me know your answer down there in the comments and I'll see you guys over in the next English quiz. Take care.